Hi everyone and welcome back, it's James. Today I have a box from Amazon. I bought a car dash cam. It costs about 36 US dollars. So let's open it, baby. Woo! All right, let's do it. Ooh, it says full HD 1080. I think it's called a Dora Reiko Drive Recorder 1080p. Anyway. It's my first time to have one of these. I'm excited. So maybe towards the end of this video, I'll post day and night shots from this cam. Here is the camera itself. FHD 1080p car DVR. This must be the power. I don't know if it came with an SD card. Anyhow, I'll just put that in here. It's a suction cup mount for the camera. This is a powerful sticker type mount. Okay. And one USB cable. I plug this in the cigarette lighter. This is for constant charging and the manual. So I ordered this actually from Amazon Japan and that's why you see Japanese. I wonder if it's in English as well. Okay, it is in Japanese. Okay, maybe if I go online and, or if I just look at the diagram, I'll figure it out. It can't be that hard, right? Okay, so I'm going to try to connect the mount to the camera. I guess you slide it like that. Yeah, just like that. Okay, and okay, it's, okay, it's mounted like this. Okay, this goes on the windshield. All right. Now, where do you put the uh, SD card? Okay, let's see if there's any power. Oh, there is some power. And it has film, so I have to peel this off. And over here as well. Okay, not enough power. Let's see if this is multilingual. I'll be right back. Gotta get this charged. That is not the right date. It's not March 28th. It's June 1st. Off camera, I was able to figure out how to switch languages. So by pressing this button over here, got me to this menu. Okay, uh, I have to press this button. 
Okay, it has multi languages. There's English at the top, and Chinese, and Japanese, and French, Dutch, Italian, Portuguese, Spanish. Okay, I'm going for English. Perfect. Okay, and I think I'm pretty much set for now. I'll just quickly go over the menu. I started off with language, frequency, format, default setting, version, park mode, date. That's what I want. I'll set it to today's date. It is June 1st. And we'll get out of this menu. Pressing the bottom button. There is auto power off screen saver beep sound and language. Okay, let's go back out of this. There. Hi guys, I went out and bought a micro SD card, a 32 gigabyte one. So I'm going to take this out and install it. Then I'll get to my car. And I believe I install it right here. Here it is. There we go. It is in. Let's give it a test. It's recording. So that means the micro SD is working. So I'll get to my car. Hi guys, welcome to my car. Here is the dash cam setup. I'm using a suction cup instead of this sticky type mount. I could use this, uh, but Anyhow, I'm just leaving that one on and here is the cord. It's plugged into my cigarette lighter. This cord is pretty long, so... I have watched other YouTube videos on how to install and neatly put away the cord. So I'll do that later on. Like I said, this is the first time to have one of these. So I went ahead and chose this suction cup mount instead of the sticker type. Hopefully it doesn't fall off. And here is the charging cable. It goes in here. And it goes all the way down to my cigarette lighter and it's indicated by red. So that means it is charging. Let's take it out for a test run. Unfortunately, it's raining. Which button do I press for record? Maybe this top button. No, picture. Oh, I took a picture. Okay. Um, okay, now it's recording. It's red. I can see the counter going up. So here I go. For this segment of the video, uh, there was no audio coming from the dash cam. I guess I had it on mute. I was just playing with it. Now I'm moving. You know, while driving, the adjustable part on the mount was loose. So I was struggling to tighten it while driving in the rain and there were cars coming towards me and you're gonna see the camera move from side to side. So sorry about the picture. I had a chance to tighten the camera because there was a car coming down the slope.
is clearing up. I'm back home and, um, you know, off camera, I went ahead and tried to tuck the cord in from up here. I just followed the advice of the other YouTubers. Thanks to those people on YouTube, I didn't have to use any tool. I just was able to tuck it behind this and go all the way down and down, down. Oh, okay, uh, I can do a better job here and back over here. So later on, I'm going to use the dash cam at night. Hi guys, I'm going to test the dash cam that I got. And I'm standing right outside of my car and it turned on by itself. It's motion censored. It's recording. to a nearby supermarket to get some groceries. Let's see if you can see me. And there is the dash cam that I bought from Amazon Japan. It's gone up in price. And this concludes my video. Thank you very much for your time. Like my video and subscribe to my channel. Till next time everyone. Bye.